Hey VIPs, it's Lexis Joy from Lex Joy VIP Access and I'm so excited to be interviewing the charming and immensely talented uh, Bertie Gilbert <laughs> and your minion friend. Minion friend, yep. <laughs> and we're here today at VidCon, so I just want to congratulate you on all the phenomenal success with your career. Thank you very much. You're Thank very you. Welcome. Now let's talk about your channel. What inspired you to start creating YouTube videos? Um, I think I, I've always had an interest in making things, and sort of my channels evolved from kind of simple, stupid sketches <laughs> to short films and feature films eventually um, so I think just sort of naturally YouTube was the platform that most people go to upload things so I naturally thought I'd go there. Wonderful and we love watching it and do you have a favorite video that you've created thus far? Um, Tough question. <laughs> yeah because uh, I've, I've made six short films now the one that we're, we're editing I'm very proud of so I think that'll probably be my favorite um, but I think I did one in March with my friend Jack Howard and a few other people. Uh, there was a film called Rocks That Bleed. Um, that's probably, I'm very proud of that one. I think there's just, yeah, I think it's the tightest of them all. Wonderful. Probably. So your fans should come below and tell us what their favorite one is, but sure. we won't be able to choose because we love all of your content. And we're here at VidCon and you get the chance to meet so many of your fans. Have you ever had any f crazy fan encounters just in general, not just this weekend? No, not really. I found the people who come up to me are always very polite and charming and sort of very eloquent with with because the nature of what I make it, it, it you know encourages people to like think about them and and sort of come up with theories and stuff so so people are always very kind and very just sort of oh you've inspired me to go to film school or whatever and I didn't go to film school but it's it's always great to make the tiniest bit of difference in people's lives um, nothing mad no just just very just nice and pleasant nice people Wonderful. Well, you are an incredible role model to all of your fans, and we're going to do speed rounds. Are you ready for it? Sure, sure. <laughs> okay, so favorite color? Uh, red. Favorite song at the moment? Uh, uh, there's uh, Looking Through You by the Beatles. Ooh, dream place to visit? Uh, Venice, even though I've already been there. Ooh, pancakes or waffles? Pancakes. <laughs> Very nice. And favorite place to eat here in L.A.? Um... I mean, I've only really been to IHOP, so I'm probably oh. going to have to say IHOP. Very it's not very cool. good, though. <laughs> very cool. And favorite movie? Eternal Sunshine of the Spotless Mind. Perfect. And favorite emoji? <laughs> I don't use emojis. I have no you idea. don't? No. Oh, that's cool. And no. favorite app? Uh, Twitter. Great. And what other upcoming projects are you working on that fans can look forward to? Um, I'm working on, like, we just shot another film um, called Blue Sushi which will be coming out, it'll be about 40 minutes, and I'm also having some meetings while I'm out here about a feature film that we should be shooting out here, and yeah. Excellent, well we can't wait to see all of your amazing projects. Again, you always do an extraordinary job. And lastly, if you could bring out one message to all of your fans, what message would that be? Um, thank you for proving that there is maybe an audience on YouTube for short films and longer form content and it isn't it doesn't all have to be simplified and stuff just thanks yeah oh wonderful well thank you so so very much all for right. speaking with me today Pleasure. I wish you continued success with your career thank and you. congrats again on everything thank bye guys much. bye <laughs>